Both Pepys and Evelyn were great shoppers. Uh, Evelyn uh, probably got the, got, caught the, the bug when he was uh, travelling around in Europe uh, in the 1640s. And he had, it describes go, coming upon a shop in Paris. I just like to describe it. Um, it's, co it's called Noah's Ark, where are to be had for money all the curiosities, natural or artificial, imaginable, Indian or European, for luxury or use, as cabinets, shells, ivories, por porcelain, dried fish, rare insects, birds, pictures, and a thousand exotic extravagances. Um, Pepys also had uh, did, uh, shopped for exotic things. He liked um, getting furnishings for the house and a gown for himself, and he did his shopping for his wife. Uh, the interesting thing about shopping at this period was that women didn't necessarily um, go out on their own and do their shopping. Uh, their husbands expected to do it for them. Pepys and Evelyn bought lots of books, and uh, Pepys describes in his diary uh, shopping. For his favourite bookseller was called Joshua Curtin, and his shop was in the precinct of St Paul's Cathedral called St Paul's Churchyard. And he describes sitting in the shop and uh, having lots of books brought for him to look at to decide which one he wants, wanted to buy.